In this video, I'm going to show you a super easy way to complete all of the three challenges for the cargo ship robbery from the salvage yard. At the time of making this, the current target is the Comet Safari, which can be sold for $345,000. But with the 50k you get from the finale challenges, this will total $395,000. These totals will vary over the different weeks, as the car you are stealing will be altered. But the strats shown in this video will work every time. So without further ado, let's get to it. The challenges for this one are no lives lost, reach the bridge undetected, and over 80% skylift health remaining. The disruption mission here stops multiple helicopters spawning in that will attack the skylift, but these are easy to deal with, so you can choose to skip this prep entirely. The first thing you want to do is completely ignore what the game tells you to do, and that is to arrive at the boat, drive it over to the ship, climb up the anchor chain, and kill everyone in your way stealthily. What you can do is fly over to the back of the ship and parachute straight down to the bridge completely unseen. If you try to land on the ship with a vehicle, you will be spotted and the challenge will fail. That's why, hear me out, knock, 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 knock. Up the anchor chain. Easy. You, lift, right, bro? you now have two guards and a captain to kill. Before grabbing the captain's phone and then downloading his ex hamster search history from his computer. It's worth noting that going straight to the bridge leaves all the other enemies alive to attack. If you killed everyone else on the ship first, you'll only really have the chopper to deal with. I found it best to take out the chopper from this area first. Then head down the stairs. It's advised to be in first person here, so you can descend the stairs faster and navigate the corridors easier. You now need to search the crates highlighted in green. The vehicle will randomly be in one of these three. To get up to these, you're looking for boxes to climb up onto. When you found the car, attach a flare to the side of it. While you wait for the skylift to arrive, grab one of the two awaiting sea sparrows. Watch my back while I hook her up. All you have to do now is accompany the skylift to the top of a chosen parking lot. Now get in the car, drive off, and deliver it back to your scrapyard.
this playthrough, I managed to complete the whole thing in under 8 minutes. All challenges completed and a nice $50,000 bonus. I say holla, you say dollar, holla! Uh, okay, uh, cool. Let's get these wheels shipped to Yusuf. Head to terminal and drop it off. I told him all about the story behind it and everything. He is psyched for real, bro. Now just deliver the car to the docks. And that sweet $395,000 is now yours. So if you found this video useful, please drop it a like and subscribe for the best GTA guides on the internet. Here are some other videos you may also enjoy. I'm Beats Down, and I'll see you in the next one.